hello let's solve for the value of m okay all right now we have square root of m sorry let me not repeat the question i want to transfer this to the other side of the equation okay and when i do that i will have what square root of m is equal to 4 minus what square root of minus m all right now let's square both sides of the equation so that i can get the value of m right so if we write square root of m squared is equal to 4 minus square root of minus m squared okay now your square is going to cancel your square root we have that m is equal to so when you have a minus what b all squared in algebra this is equal to a squared minus 2ab plus b squared okay that is the algebra identity for a minus b squared now in this case our a is 4 and our b is square root of minus m okay so we are going to express it in this form using the algebra identity so it's going to be a squared that is 4 squared minus 2ab that is 2 multiplied by a which is 4 multiplied by b which is square root of minus m then plus b squared that is going to be plus square root of minus m squared okay now our m is equal to 4 squared will give us what 16 now 2 times 4 is 8 so we are going to have 8 root minus m okay so it's going to be minus what 8 root minus m now here your square root will cancel your square root will cancel your square and you're left with minus m and minus times plus will give us minus right so we have minus m all right now let's transfer this to the other side of the equation and when we do that we have m minus 16 is equal to minus 8 square root of minus m minus what m okay oh let's also transfer this minus m to the other side to know that we are just dealing with this one okay so we have m minus 16 minus m we cross to become plus m okay is equal to minus 8 square root of minus m okay now let's continue m plus m we give us 2m right minus 16 minus 16 is equal to minus 8 square root of what minus m all right we still have square root sign here let's square both sides of this equation to clear it okay so we are going to square this side and we're also going to square this side so we have already expanded something in this form right that is a minus b squared is equal to a squared minus 2ab plus b squared okay so that means in this case our a is 2m while our b is what 16 so it's going to be a squared that is 2m squared okay minus 2ab that is 2 multiplied by 2m multiplied by 16 okay plus b squared that is plus 16 squared all right and this is equal to this is same thing as what minus 8 squared okay multiplied by square root of minus m squared okay so here we have 2 squared we give us 4 m squared minus 2 times 16 is 32 and 32 times 2 we give us 64 so we have 64 m plus 16 squared okay okay now 16 squared is 256 am i sure okay let's do it now i'm going to use a trick to be faster there's a math trick for it so 6 squared will give us 36 1 squared will give us 1 now 1 times 6 is 6 double of 6 is 12 so i'll add i'll have 256 so the answer is 256 oh all right so if you want to learn these tricks i have uh, three videos for them in this channel so just quickly so uh, search through the channel is not that far about a month or two months ago just search through the channel and you are going to see 
videos on math tricks okay okay now 4m squared minus 64m plus 256 right is equal to minus 8 squared is 64 now this we remove this and we have what multiply by minus m all right so we have 4m squared minus 64m plus 256 is equal to minus 64 m okay so let's bring this to this side if we do that we will have 4 m squared minus 64 m plus 256 plus 64 m is equal to zero okay now minus 64 m plus 64 m is zero so this and this we go is zero so we have 4 m squared plus 256 is equal to zero if this is the first time you're coming across this channel please click on the subscription button and turn on your notification bell yes so that you don't miss our amazing videos okay and please give us a thumbs up if you are actually enjoying this video thank you so much all right now we have 4m squared plus 256 and repeating what we have here is equal to zero now let's divide through by four okay let's divide through by four so divided by four divided by four divided by four so you have m squared plus now when 25 is divided by four we have six six remainder one if we divide 16 we have four all right is equal to zero so we have that m squared is equal to minus 64 now, to get the value of m, we're going to take square root of both sides of the equation, right? So, we have square root of m squared is equal to square root of minus 64, all right? Okay, now this, we remove this, we have m is equal to plus or minus. Now, square root of, this is same thing as square root of 8 multiply. sorry, square root of 64, okay? multiply by square root of minus one now your m is equal to plus or minus square root of 64 is 8 multiplied by now square root of minus one minus one is same thing as i squared all right so we have that m is equal to plus or minus 8 and square root of i squared so your square is going to cancel the square roots and you have i